One player, two player, put controller in, and they turn the power button on and say, POWER ON! What movie? He, uh, he, what was it? Huey Halloween or Huey whatever? Halloween? Yeah. Because it looked like it was just going to be a silly Adam Sandler doing one of his characters movie. Or was it, like, not that at all? For Hubie Halloween? Yeah. No, I, I think it was billed as the the wacky Adam Sandler movie. And it just wasn't that? Well, no, Hubie Halloween was a... You saw Hubie Halloween. No, no, I didn't. Not yet. No, Hubie Halloween's like a very bog-standard Adam Sandler movie. I okay. haven't seen it. My, I've seen bits of it, but it was, it was not very good. All right. From what I've seen. Well, and, I'll check it out. It's on Netflix. Is, uh... Well, I, I guess I'll just never see it then, because uh, I'm not paying for Netflix. Who fucks if I do that? And I'm not going to... Okay, let me let me get this straight, okay? Let, let me just get this out there right now. It's not just Netflix is stupid about this. Just hear me out. I'm paying thirteen ninety nine for a streaming service, right? Why in the fuck would I want to pay thirteen ninety nine for something... And then have to watch ads. I'm not gonna pay thirteen ninety nine for ads. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. This is just cable, like. Then it's just cable, and cable's more expensive. So like, it's just it's what? Why? Why would I do either of those? The whole point of paying for a streaming service is it's the opposite of cable, and it's cheaper. Yeah, it's, it's supposed to be, like, the better alternative to cable. It's supposed to be cable without ads. You're no longer the product that you're supposed to be. Why would I pay for you? Yeah, kind of the appeal of streaming services is, like, really... That's why, I, like, I, I don't like the fact that I'm paying for Hulu, and I still get ads. So that's why I'm gonna just go get Funimation Plus. Yeah, Funimation is a fucking shitty ass company, but at least I get to watch anime without fucking ads! Get on. And then they have a free version that has ads! That's literally what it should be! A free version of the thing that I have to pay for where I get ads, or I pay for it and then don't get ads. Yeah, it's like it's like the YouTube premium thing. I pay for that. YouTube premium makes fucking sense. I, I watch enough YouTube that I'm like, well, it just makes sense. I just put up with the ads because I don't care one way or the other. But like, you, like if I'm if I'm paying for streaming, I should not have ads. It doesn't matter how much I'm paying. The fact that I'm paying you means I shouldn't get ads. It's just weird to me. I I feel like that's it, it's odd. It's six p.m. Ooh. Yippee! And that's the last orb here, or power cell here. Nice. It's we fucking, out? it's weird. Controversial opinion, I know. <laughs> Ads? No good. Um, it's, it's weird. Oh, we, got all the we have this Netflix sharing thing. There have been so many cancellations. I don't think Netflix is going to be around. It sucks. They, they make good stuff on Netflix every now and then. For, for a little bit they were, yeah. I, I wonder how that's going to affect Stranger Things, because they've got another season coming. And, like... If Netflix goes bankrupt before that comes out, I, that's that's curious. Cause like, where do Stranger Things go? What I think they should do is they should start uh, the process of like moving over to moving over to HBO Max or something like that. Yeah, HBO Max was like super good for a bit, and then they just and then they removed all yeah, the and they just removed fucking everything. Yeah. 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 That was like the one thing I'm like, okay, this made sense. Like, you know, this is a good streaming service. There's a lot of really good stuff. They were they were making, I mean, they're still making really good, like, original content for HBO Max. But, like, they had a bunch of really good old stuff on HBO and Max. And then you have that new fucking director who's, like, terrible at lying. Oh, yeah. <laughs> who's like, yeah, the Batgirl movie was just awful. And I'm like, I don't fucking believe you for a goddamn second because... All these cartoons that were great, you fucking said were awful. So, Infinity Train? Infinity Train. <laughs> fucking stupid, dude. You removed Batgirl because it was a tax write-off. Shut up. Just, I wish they'd be honest. I would love that. Well, he can't legally say that. That's true. 
But I, I'd love to live in the reality where you could. Because that would be tax evasion or whatever. You just say, yep, roll it off because tax. And tax was no good. Then he runs away. So that's why he's that's why he's saying right now that like it was just awful is because like if he if he doesn't it would it, they would it be was, very it was, clear it was a tax right it was on it was unreleasable it was unreleasable this fight like it was shit and everybody else is like no it wasn't it had Brendan fucking Fraser in it and he was in Blast from the Past God that was a good a movie. movie that was a fucking hilarious ass film and then he got real serious real quick. <laughs> That shit gets real heavy. I, I started that movie. I haven't, I haven't watched it all the way through. Yeah, it's a, it's a good movie. It's hard for me to watch movies nowadays because it's just a trauma. Um, I used to watch movies with my best friend for a while there, and now I don't. So it's really hard for me to watch movies by myself. I'm making progress, though. I watched... Um, fucking, what was the... I watched uh, Matthew McConaughey in uh, Lincoln Lawyer. Phenomenal film. Like, holy shit, what a good movie. Highly recommend. Can't recommend enough, actually. And then I watched... Um, I started watching Demon Slayer. Which is... <sighs> Sorry. That one's an anime. And, uh... Fucking nothing but good things to say. I'm gonna be watching the Lord of Rings films by myself for the first time ever. That was a good one. Yeah, oh, I um I watched them when I was kids with my dad, which is the main reason why I haven't watched them since because I like I don't I don't like the fact that I can't watch them with him anymore. Depressing, I know. Moving on. Um, but I remember finally sit down and watch them and actually pay attention, so that I can get the story. Because <laughs> I know they're good. I watched The Hobbits by myself. I enjoyed the shit out of those movies. Not great adaptations, but I... if you just watch them as films, fucking fucking great time. See, the thing with me is, like, the, the for me, the first Hobbit's really good. And then, like... I do wish they had just done Desolation of Smog and the Five Armies as one thing. Yeah, it's, it is really weird. That they didn't the, have to the split five, that. Yeah, five, five Armies gets is, like, an entire movie. They should have just called them The Hobbit, An Unexpected Journey, and then The Hobbit, The Five Armies, just like they fucking were. Like, like there's literally an animated collection of two films... One of which is called An Unexpected Journey. The other one is called The Five Armies. The Battle of the Five Armies. That's what they just should have fucking done. Yeah, it needed to be an epic trilogy. Make it a trilogy like The Lord of the Rings. Like, or, the or, reason, or, but or, the thing, like, it doesn't, it doesn't work as a trilogy. The, the point of, like, The Hobbit as a story is it's so, like... It's fucking... It's, it's so it's, much lighter and simpler. It's so much, like... It's, it's not an epic. It's, yeah. It, there, there's well, a, it's an epic in the sense that it's... It's an adventure. It's not yeah. an epic. Well, I would call it an epic because it's a it's a small man taking on an incredibly epic journey of... of Grand proportions. Yeah, exactly. Like, he's, he's a man of very simple pleasures, doesn't want anything to do with the adventure that he's being put into, and is thrust into it. That's an epic. But also... It's an epic that takes place within one book. <laughs> yeah, it's. <laughs> you didn't it's, have to make a, it three. It's, it's not a. It's not a trilogy epic. It's. It's a. At most, it's it's a duology. It's a. Yes, yeah, it's a, a two movie epic. And that's only because there's a lot that happens between when he gets to Smog, and when he gets to the Battle of the Five Armies. Like a lot. A lot happens. Well, I have all these. Uh, good news, we can get that uh, last yeah I've... last uh, power cell from those miners. Uh, bad news, I can't find this last one. I want to go to school. Back to school season's coming up. Get it, miner? Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. I, I look, I've, I've been tempted to make a joke about miners. Yeah, but I made one, and it wasn't like you know, it wasn't bad. It was, it was just kind of like it was a bad joke. It was, it was, it was there, yeah. <laughs> Three star best. I'm excited about uh, they're talking about getting uh, Peter Jackson in to do um, some more Little of the Rings fa uh, films, and I'm excited because uh, there was talk between him and the actor Viggo Morgensen yeah. to do an Aragon movie, and I'm like, fucking please do it, because there's so much cool lore regarding him in the books that like you don't get to see 
in the three, the trilogy. So if you just took all of that and made a movie about Aragorn, that'd be fucking amazing. Because he's done some cool shit. Oh, it would just be so good. And then you have uh, the movie with um, Legolas who wanted to do. Fuck it, I would adore, I would adore either of those films. He could, he could call it the, uh, the Epic of Aragorn, and then the Leagues of Legolas. Those are just ideas. Like, for, for film night, hey, Peter Jackson, if you're listening. <laughs> like, either of those films would be great. I wonder if, if he does the uh, Chiridian or whatever it is. Oh, the Silmarillion? Yeah, the Silmarillion. If he does that, um... Don't do it in three films. Do more. Actually give it, like, time to fucking ruminate and be told correctly. Um, don't do a TV show like Rings of Power. Um, Where they didn't get the rights to that book, and so they didn't really do it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Do, do the, 